Yo, my name's Startsy. I'm a 21 year old musician from Mitcham. Starts to be the Glad Minister, starts to be the M Town Dream, starts to be the Entrepreneur Glad of Pick One. I got started with music just from like school days, youth clubs, and that. It was just something that you would do and there's like the reaction. I think that's what really captured me. I was like, rah, I just said a few words and then it's like the reaction was really big, innit? So just carried on doing that. It ended up escalating and here we are man, still working. I'm 21 now. I've been taking it seriously from about 16 to be very honest with you. I won't lie and say, man's just taking music seriously from yesterday. No, I took music seriously from that. As soon as I knew that, rah, I, I stole a couple of mixtapes, I can make a little bit of money from this and it's actually something that I fell in love with, you know what I'm trying to say. So from 16, I, was, I made like, my first grand off of music, I was just selling CDs like, in school. And then um, and locally, then from there, it kind of went on to um, pressing them up and putting them in shops. Look. Shouldn't let me get my hands on this. Start seeing a Peter Faber, I'm a hands on kid. You can bank on this if I use the deep. I was putting them in the stores, and one of the stores actually had a distribution company that was looking after them. And um, it's only 10 CDs I put in that store, but on like I put it in on like the Tuesday, and by the Thursday, all 10 were gone. So to them, it looked like a big deal. It's only 10 CDs, but I happened to be in the right place at the right time. They had just got in um, business with this distribution company. They then forwarded my name onto them as someone that they might want to work with and then I've had a distribution deal with them ever since so all my stuff will be on like all digital outlets and stuff. Right now, I'll be moving at a million miles an hour Catch me if you're stupid, hit his heart with power Call a nigga Cupid, I attract a few chicks and I ain't really seeing shit You should see the looseness and I don't even game a skip, period I got nominated for um, Best Hip Hop at last year's Official Mixtape Awards which um, for me as someone who I feel I get overlooked a lot like for where I feel like I should be but I can't blame no one else for that but myself I just got to keep working and keep grinding for me but um, I really appreciated that recognition you get me the OME is so in love and that I did not expect to get a nomination so um, yeah appreciate that a lot um, it was actually for Prepare for Glide Off which was an EP even that we did um, and that really showed me about like quality control over my music because that was only 8 tracks whereas a lot of my other mixtapes would have been like 15 tracks, 18 tracks, 20 tracks, you know what I mean? Like, but the eight that we picked, like, it was a plan for like each one. And um, what you're saying was actually on AKA and it was my first video on Flavor as well. Um, that's, that was that head single off of that. And that was on there from about the summer to the end of last year. So um, it shows that if you've got a quality song, sometimes it's better than just having a whole load of average ones. You know? And then keep smiling with the follow up, which people loved as well. So. Look, got nominated for a OMA. Wow, that's Greece. Now I'm on flavor. Woo, what a week. Who would have who would have fought me? Starter from the M. Yes, yeah, south of the water. Came up my mother 1991. In between her like for feisty one you are not me. Told you. I got into flavor TV through. Um, I got my music video on there. I just sent it in and like I think that's probably the first video I sent to them because I always thought nah, they're not gonna claim me. But I feel like if you defeat yourself before you started, you fuck yourself up. It was you know one of them. Like, 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 say in the industry there's a lot of phony people or, or people who are like not genuine but yeah man um, Sarah over Flavor was really good to me they then um, had me and four freestyle frenzy on their channel as well which like, I appreciated and they've just been showing me love ever since so I got I got bare love for Flavor you man blow like Lewinsky when I'm in the club I do it all I got hot steps why would I be hanging on the wall I ain't a cobweb I be all around the room and I hype give it to her then she give it back boom around when if you want to hate, but they hate me, I can blow your top away. Have you on the front page, same time page free, but success is the best form of revenge, though. I'm going to keep it normal again, bro. Bye. Gliding means that it means a lot of things. That like Nowadays, it's, I use it as like a, a metaphor for being above bullshit, like, but still being close enough to know about it. So I don't want to be 
so gone I feel like there's some people that are so gone they kind of forget about where they came, came from so instead of being that high up over that like, I'd say gliding in it like so man's still low enough to um, connect with where I came from but doesn't mean I want to stay there so it's kind of like a balance in between that's one one meaning another meaning just like anything good is like gliding like when you get a bit gassed like oh shit gliding I'm gliding you get me like that's another reason and then it's just that like, gliding is good and sliding is bad and that's what we, we say in it like stream of vision that's how it started and it just got a bit out of control but um, I think the first time I ever said it was one of my brethren's that like, he was he had smoked a little bit too much he's like oh shit I was glad it was ah, and I don't even smoke in it like, so yeah so he can probably claim a bit of copyright towards that I see darkness and pagans heading to the light. No, I start never gave and they tell me start you work too hard. I'm like, no, nah, real boy, you work too soft. I'm the hood's hottest like dice and I'm way there. Can't cool me down with no ice, little boy, yeah. Lock myself away in the dungeon and get busy. Cause a Ross Clark can too loud. Who's with me? Trying to avoid the plain clothes. I'm man screaming out my.